This morning, one year after the ransack of the U.S. Capitol, President Biden set to address the nation, saying in part, are we going to be a nation that accepts political violence as a norm? Are we going to be a nation where we allow partisan election officials to overturn the legally expressed will of the people? NBC News has learned officials have observed an uptick in calls for unspecified acts of violence in the past 48 hours linked to the anniversary, according to a senior intelligence official. Still, law enforcement is not aware of a specific credible threat for today. The next time that we're tested, um, uh, we will not be making those same mistakes. The officers who fought on the front lines that day remember the violent mob who tested them and the fury they still feel. Are you still angry about what happened on the 6th? Hell yeah, I'm angry. I'm absolutely angry. Arresting the rioters who attacked police that day is now a top priority for the FBI, conducting one of its farthest reaching investigations ever, fueled by more than 300,000 tips from across the country. We've had uh, restaurant workers um, turn, uh, turn somebody in uh, because they've overheard them talking about, about it. So far, according to the attorney general, the sprawling investigation has led to more than 700 arrests, with about a quarter of those arrested pleading guilty. All while the Congressional Committee investigating the insurrection has pushed deeper into the former president's inner circle. Late Wednesday, interviewing former White House Press Secretary Stephanie Grisham. But I cooperate fully and I will continue to do so. For Officer Dunn, without full accountability, closure on that violent day remains elusive. Did that day ever really end for you? I don't feel like you can totally heal or have closure to something until you have accountability until you know the full picture of what happened. What that accountability means is very much an open question. Yesterday, the attorney general said they, the Department of Justice would pursue the perpetrators at any level. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.